Look, most important thing dealing with foreign leaders, in my experience, and I've dealt with an awful lot of them over my career, is just know the other guy. So you know Vladimir Putin, you think he's a killer? Mm-hmm, I do. So what price must he pay? The price he's gonna pay, well, you'll see shortly. Director of National Intelligence came out with a report today saying that Vladimir Putin authorized operations during the election to under denigrate you, support President Trump, undermine our elections, divide our society. What price must he pay? He will pay a price. I, we had a long talk, he and I. We've, I, I know him relatively well. And I, the conversation started off. I said, I know you and you know me. If I establish this occurred, then be prepared. You said you know he doesn't have a soul. I did say that to him, yes. And, to, and his response was, we understand one another. I wasn't being a wise guy. I was alone with him in his office. That's how it came about. It was when President Bush had said, I've looked in his eyes and saw a soul. I said, looked in your eyes, and I don't think you have a soul. And looked back at me and said, we understand each other. And by the way, we ought to be able that old, that trite expression, walk and chew gum at the same time. There are places where it's in our mutual interest to, to uh, work together. That's why I renewed the START agreement with him. That, ha that occurred while he's doing this. That, but that's overwhelming in the interest of humanity that we diminish the prospect of a nuclear exchange.